I'm currently working in IT and would like to transition into cybersecurity role. First, make sure that you have premium membership. Go to jobscashare.org, click on membership. And once you have premium membership, you can click on dashboard and then click on roadmaps. Cybersecurity is an advanced role in IT. It is not a role where someone can just switch a career and would like to start IT career from scratch and they can just pick cybersecurity easily. Now it's possible, but in JSS, we like to go with the things that are normal and on average people will get into IT easily. And that is the first course that basically we have designed Modern IT Support Career Roadmap. In this, you need to learn fundamentals, what is network, domain network, and all of that, which is going to be extremely important when you are getting into cybersecurity. And that is why we consider cybersecurity more advanced career than just normal IT support jobs. So in this case, we only offer a practical approach right now in our platform. And practical in a, in a sense where once you get into this type of labs, you already know the basics. So here we have a very lengthy practical approach towards cybersecurity technical skills. And once you are ready to start your journey to learn cybersecurity skills, you're going to come over here and start the journey for this practice lab roadmap. On the top, you will see a button, which I already did. You can start the roadmap. And here it will start with the first course, which is called Cybersecurity Fundamentals, and that it will teach you the basics of uh, cybersecurity. And then, of course, without Linux, you really can't do a technical job in cybersecurity. So you will learn about Linux, which is a brand new course. And then after that, you're going to get into more technical cybersecurity analyst type of learning. And it goes beyond that. Once you finish this, it goes to red team and blue team fundamentals, and then it goes to pen testing. And lastly, you're going to do some vulnerability testing. Once you learn all these skills, this will become very easy for you. We are also working on a coaching program where cybersecurity experts and other cybersecurity trainers will teach you just like how our coaching services works. You're going to be in a Discord. We will give you extra material so then you can prepare yourself for certifications such as CompTIA 701, which is the latest one. And then we will also help give you more material from an expert trainers who can bring their knowledge to you in cybersecurity. That is something we are working on currently. You can go to our website, send us an email. Whenever it's ready, we can let you know. But at this point, you can, if you even finish the cybersecurity fundamental Linux and this course, at this point, you are already getting prepared for that entry level jobs in cybersecurity. And you will need to do this in our platform because uh, we believe uh, highly in, in the hands-on skills. So this is something you have to do, whether you take our coaching program or not. Um, you still need to do these labs to be, to be able to become uh, that technical professional where you can, can tell other people that you have done some sort of projects and they will take you seriously then to give you the, these type of roles that are more advanced than just IT support. Now, before starting cybersecurity roadmap, let me show you exactly how you need to prepare yourself before you start these labs. So once you click on start journey, and then once you are in the journey and you start the journey, when you click on start the journey, this is going to take you directly to the lab if you click on this. But before this, you need to actually take the lab tour to understand how to use the lab system. That's very important if you're new to our platform. So how will you do this? You go back to the practice labs tab right here. And here on the top, we have Launch Orientation Lab. You need to make sure you finish this lab. And then this way, you will understand how to use the devices, how to run the machines and things like that, and how to get the support. Do remember that JSS support does not provide internal lab issues. So if you are going to have any issues that's related to a document not working or devices being slow or connections issues and things like that, you need to reach out to the lab support, which is inside the practice lab portal so this is why it is very important if you're new to a platform and you have not taken any other roadmaps because in our video courses we teach a lot about how you need to do things and how you need to turn our machines and things like that and where to get the support but if you're not doing that approach let's say you're going directly to this practice lab roadmap you won't be able to see those videos for you to come over here and click on launch orientation labs and finish that and then you can go back to your roadmaps 
and start doing the labs directly. So let me demonstrate how you are going to do this. You're going to come back to cybersecurity and click on start, start your journey because you have already started that. And on the top, click on start your journey, then click on cybersecurity fundamentals. And this will start the lab process. So here on the on the right side, you can see the modules and everything. And on the right side, you see the launch button. So once you click on launch, this is going to start the whole lab. And then you can learn from the left side step by step. And on the right side, you have all the machines that are available in this lab. So you can see it tells you learning outcome and everything over here. And you can click next here and then keep on doing this till you finish this lab. And then you move on to the next lab in this roadmap.